Continue to monitor the weather as it progresses over the next couple of hours. FBO went to the air to ground on one contact. Copy loud and clear also. DHUD, CGSF, JPSX, verify active on 212 and monitor 232 for remainder of count. HUD, CGSF, verify. CSF, verified, JPSX. JPSX, verified. Put the entity on 212 and 232, conducting a T minus 20 minute briefing. Page 857. Out of one launch window opens at 1350 GMT, closes two and a half hours later at 1620 GMT. Second launch attempt is possible. There are no COLAs for today's launch. The holder's request is issued between T minus 9 minutes and T minus 31 seconds. The countdown clock will be restarted upon successful resolution of a problem without a go survey made of all elements. If the launch cannot be accomplished within the launch window or the following time is exceeded, the cutoff will be called. Launch frame back hold time is 4 minutes 47 seconds. TLT at T minus 5 minutes before making the start upon command of OTC only. Yep, TLT copy. And CDR, the pad egress system, is in normal configuration and actually still at number eight. Oh, yeah, copy. And fire and launch team, please disable your telephone ring at this time. Ingress and egress, the fire will not be allowed after resuming the count at T minus 20 minutes until after launch or flight crew egress if a recycle occurs. All personnel not active in terminal count, monitor only, OIS channel 217. All personnel, please bear in mind critical post-launch operations will be in progress after successful launch, so please keep fire room activities and noise to a minimum. After T minus 20 minutes, all problems or trends that require a countdown clock hold will be reported to entity on 212 together with recommendations. After T minus 5 minutes, any hold manual or GLS should be accompanied by a description of the problem and recommendations. Countdown clock will continue until T minus 31 seconds unless the recommendation to hold of the next milestone is necessary.
personnel says you can't two twelve any conversation on two twelve during the after comp test will be heard by the crew. Channel should remain silent except for emergency calls. And flight crew this OTC you can adjust your volume as per required for comfort. Do not change audio channel switch configuration. We're ready to remove the probe from the side hatch. Go on and form the CDR and the crew to remove the master arm and the flaps to do the hatch back check to see them. Copy. CDR, you copy? CDR, yeah, copy. OTC, CDR. I have a set my procedure to have you notify OVCC to continue fly hat and close out for off port 20. Okay. OVCC. A copy. Buddy, I have a set my procedure to have you notify OVCC to continue fly hat and close out for off port 20. Okay. OVCC. A copy.